the, there, there's this idea of your parents. Um, I was thinking, we, give, we just read this week's parsha, the bracha that we give our children, Yivarech Hashem Yishmarecha, Yer Hashem Panavilecha Bichunecha, Yisra Hashem Panavilecha Bichunecha Bichunecha So we're asking at the end, Hashem grant us the countenance and the light, but I kind of think that this might be a, since the parents are giving it, since Hashem is our parent, I think the first two components of the bracha are very important. A good, a loving Hashem and a good parent understands that the way to get anyone to grow and to be happy is to feel blessed. Hashem should feel blessed. Hashem should be happy like he was with Fanny Ganasha. So when we have to work, we work on our happiness and we feel good about our children, we feel good about ourselves. That's number one. Because that reflects and that goes down to our children. And that's why I think it goes to the Rech Hashem Yishmerecha, because these are the vitals before we're going to end up getting in Rech Hashem, the countenance of Hashem. So our job as parents and educators and Rabbanim and everyone here invested in your future, guys, has been to be happy with you, Simcha, which you have definitely brought us tremendous amount of Simcha the last few weeks. Simcha doesn't come easy. And we feel blessed through you. Our children, or we don't just call them our children, but we call them our builders. You built us. You pushed us to grow in many ways. That's for sure, right? And the Yishmarecha, which we have this responsibility, and you know, the Chavaz Allah, the Chavaz Allah writes, our job is not to get too involved, not to not to be too overbearing. Our job is to be Yishmarecha, just to, he writes here, basically Ganenet. Our job is to be the Ganin Ganen Hashem. We're here to guard for you. We're here to take care of you and guard you and watch you. And I believe these ideas is everything for this beautiful partnership. And the, and the representation of Hashem, for now we have a Yeshua Kehla Shita who has followed the story and follow your story and have been so impressed with your growth and see so much in your future and has accepted not an easy task out there the, to this idea of rabbinical authority which is, you know, can get dramatic at times probably but he's taking the legal fires because he believes in you and he's a very busy man and we have a, we're honored to have you say a few words <laughs>